Protest in Iran growing tonight after morality police arrested a 22 year old woman for not properly wearing her headscarf. The hijab is mandatory for Iranian women. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Carlo Chiquetto. Marcella Lee is off tonight. That woman died in custody, triggering these historic protests that are being watched across the globe, including here. CBS 8's Kirsten Holmes has been following the story for us, joins us live right now with local reaction. Kirsten? Yeah, Iranian police say Messiah Amini died of a heart attack and deny that she was mistreated, but her family says she has no history of heart trouble. As those protests and demonstrations you see behind me grow, Iranian Americans in San Diego say they can only sit back and watch in horror. This is a tragedy and atrocity. It's crucial for us who have the means to increase the awareness on the global scene to spread their voices. My hope is for the world leaders uh, to acknowledge these atrocities um, for what they are. Sada Tagavi is Iranian American and lives in San Diego. As of Thursday afternoon, at least nine protesters have been killed in Iran. Sada says citizens of Iran are standing up to this conservative regime enforcing Sharia law. It basically eliminates all the basic human rights, in particular women's rights, imposing harsh restrictions on women's dress, child custody, foreign travel, divorce, and the list goes on. Brave women in Iran are risking their lives, cutting off their hairs, okay. burning their hijabs in protest, demanding justice, justice, respect, and freedom under the slogan, women, life, freedom, zan zendegi azadi. They're my sisters, they're my daughters. Human rights matter and women's rights matter. Ali Sada is also Iranian American and has lived in San Diego for decades. He says it doesn't matter where or who you are. Injustice anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere. It doesn't matter if you're a man or woman. I mean, uh, you're a human being and uh, women's rights is human rights. Both Sarah and Ali tell me that internet connection for citizens of Iran has been cut off, leaving the country citizens with limited information about what's going on outside of what they're already being told by Iranian-run state media. There is a vigil for Massa right here in San Diego at the House of Iran this weekend from 11 to 1 if you want to come out and honor her life. Carlo.